Yeah, Marla and Christine, the conditions were so dangerous that the 18 freeway was closed. Today, though, it has reopened to residents only. So far, San Bernardino County Fire confirms that sadly they found two people deceased on the mountain, but say both were in hospice. But we spoke to a woman tonight who tells us she knows of at least one other death and fears there could be more. We went to check on her and she was dead in her home. The mountains of snow outside and the thought of others trapped in homes has kept Christy Baltizor up for days. She already lost one friend and neighbor in the aftermath of the storm and fears there are many more. She was not ill. She was not disabled. She was a very active, vibrant, you know, person. But there's, in my mind, no other explanation for her death except that she froze. That's why she says she's screaming on social media for help. Last week, she started a form that auto-populates on its spreadsheet that lets people say where they are and what they need, then shows them on a map. She says what has come in has been staggering. Hundreds of people still trapped and problems mounting. We are asphyxiating because the heat sources up here are mostly gas, and there's so much snow on the roofs that the exhaust pipes are blocked. She tells us she has tried giving the data to San Bernardino County agencies, but so far none has accepted it. On Monday, Cal Fire San Bernardino posted video of them pulling out a patient on a sled on a snow covered street. And Baltizor says many of the communities on her spreadsheet are also covered in ice, only its neighbors who are having to come to their rescue. None of us are first responders. We're just neighbors that care about our neighbors and want to see them again. You know, and we don't want to see them come out of here in body bags. And adding to her frustration, she says LA County Urban Search and Rescue reached out to her after seeing her posts. Tonight, San Bernardino County Fire confirms they did get an offer of help from that agency, but says they turned them down because they already have enough people with that expertise on the mountain. Live outside of San Bernardino, I'm Christy Fajardo. Let's send it back to you.